What's up guys? Come to the new Minecraft video today, and today I'm going to be continuing my Let's Play series. So this is episode 11, and today, well, I figured since I haven't actually made a Let's Play in a really long time, like just, you know, one-on-one, -on -one and, you know, talking to everyone, so I figured I'd show, you know, the, some, some of the changes I made um, in the city, or the, some of the changes that have been made, uh, like resident wise uh <coughs> what new buildings there are etc etc so um obviously this is my this is actually my old home um i'm selling this home to someone so i haven't really s decided who the the person who i'm selling it to is but uh, what we'll see, I guess, on that because I'm just I'm gonna get rid of that basically and move on to bigger and better things. So, um, this is a smelting factory thing. It's not completed yet, but supposedly it works. Um, a resident in the town who's living been living here for a while is decided to make that for me. Um, this is the public farm, obviously, as you know. But I made a second extension, so this is the auto cactus farm. And what it does here is the cactus is pushed off these little cactus blocks every time it grows because cactus doesn't grow around blocks, so it'll be pushed into the water, be thrown into this stream all the way down and into the hoppers. Um, right here, you'll find that there's no cactus, and that's because I just collected it. But it does work. I do have an item elevator that it goes from here and it pushes up the cactus, and then that's where it goes into the hoppers full of chests. Um, one second. This is the Windhelm Community Center. So, basically, in here you can find the town rules, so Windhelm rule board, and the building code. So, when you're becoming a resident here, you have to follow those rules, obviously, and you also have to follow the building code if you're going to make a house here. Um, <clears throat> like a boss 21197 bought a house here. Um, oh, that's right. Frigus. I don't know if. Fr oh, sorry. I don't know if you saw in the last video that I made. Frigus Blooded. He is actually living here now. But he, I think he's going to move into the house I just told about. Um, but we'll see about that. Cause he said he doesn't have the diamonds or something. It's some kind of story. So, yeah. <laughs> um,. Other than that, I I don't know if you were here for the tunnel. I made a tunnel here, and there is one more person who lives here now, and that would be DLB Noob. So DLB lives in that wonderful home. That's a nice home. And Johnny SNTS is going to be building a park here. So we're going to have a little park. It's going to be a nice little extension, but we're going to be adding a lot to this town. Um, not necessarily in this direction, but we're definitely going to be moving oh, forward. So we're probably going to move up maybe in this vast area. Or over here. Kenji Miner is going to build a home there, supposedly. Um, but we still have like all this open land over here, so we should be able to build something Or build well, not build something, but we should be able to build um, homes there for people to live so Now the thing you've all been wanting to wait see now um, This is my new home. This is the it's like the wind home. I guess castle mansion thingy. Yeah um, Inside it isn't completely done yet, but we do have a Nectus and I have been decorating it. Nectus has been a really big help, and I think I'm a lot for him. But this is the dining room. Um, we got our like our nether brick. I really like the nether brick in here, with the glowstone and the stone brick. The stone brick matches, and then the nether brick adds in. Um, this is my throne. Uh, I haven't completed this room yet, because obviously you can't just have like a bare throne. And I'm probably gonna work a little bit on the throne. It just doesn't look as grand as I want it to be look. So. But, for now, that's what we got. Um, right in here, it's just a little sitting area because I didn't really know what to do with this area. Um, and then we got our balcony. 
And last but not least, this is my bedroom. So this is where I'll be storing all my stuff and sleeping and all that fun stuff. Also, the last part that I want to show you was down here. You'll see my cellar. So I basically I created well I didn't create this. We created this during the let's play, but it wasn't finished completely when we decided to oh there goes optifine <laughs> when we made it. So Donic put put those blocks back. My brother's behind me. <laughs> um You don't wanna show us in the other room? No, I can show you, but there's another way to get into there. Put that back. Mm. Alright. So let me randomly cl right click. Oh, there. Is. there. Oh, alright, screw this. I'm just gonna go down. Oh, don't mind this. There we go. Alright, so my brother decided to make this weird dungeon. Um, now that there's your arrow in your face. Um, so the, don't worry about the signs. I'm not even gonna show you. It's weird, but. <laughs> Yeah, D Dominic made, it's, it's basically, he, he calls it the sex dungeon, so we're just going to leave it at that. I'm not going to talk it. Oh yeah, um, speaking of night, because it is night, almost day, it's turning night, or it's turning day. Um, I have put in an automatic light system, so throughout the town you'll see these little redstone lamps, I need to fill that in, redstone lamps with half slabs on top of them. And I basically wired throughout the whole town these things ne right to a daylight sensor, which can be located right. Oh, sorry. Right here in this daylight sensor in this glass, right here. So, um, you basically, if you're interested at all, um, this when it's day, it will sell send out a current, and when it when you send out the current you're gonna invert the circuit or yeah you need to invert the circuit for these things to turn off when it is time like of day so when this circuit is on right this torch will turn off and that will lead to this turning off when this is off it'll turn on and then you see it's on so um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much how that works. Oh, and now blaring in your sound is probably this nether portal. Um, this is actually the last thing. I, I forgot about this. This is fairly new. So this is the Windhelm nether um, fortress thing. I don't know what I'm going to do with these chests yet, but it's pretty cool. Don't ask me how the admins did this it's probably world edit or something but I didn't do it so yeah and this is our enchanting room it's pretty nice and in here you'll you'll see it's it's they decided to make it funny by making a landscape as if we were in Windhelm on the other side so this is the Windhelm radio station right there so yeah that just kind of sums up like all that's we've added to Windhelm. Um, there's definitely, oh sorry, there's definitely a lot more interest in you guys wanting to live here and buying homes here, which is great. I really like that you guys really want to join me in my town and creation of it. So it's really become a, a large success in my opinion really, because we're, I mean, we're not really expanding our borders and stuff, but we're becoming more of we're becoming more technological by adding, you know, that cactus farm, the the factory. I mean, we I did enough of you like me, I guess, to donate a lot of stuff for this to happen. This is awesome. This looks really nice, and I'm I'm still going to improve it probably a little bit. Maybe like in here, this cobblestone, I might change up a little bit or something like that. But it's really great that I can have you guys, um, you know, help me out when I want or not when I want when I need you. Um, and it, uh, I really thank you for that. So, yeah, so that's just, I guess, a, a progress report on what's going on in Windhelm. Um, I know I haven't made one of these Let's Play videos in a while, and I'm kind of sorry for that. It's just um, between school, because I do have finals, you know. Well, actually, my last finals are tomorrow. But um, 
after that my school ends thank god uh but i won't have too much time to too much extra time that is i mean i, I still have a job and everything else so it's kind of hard but yeah anyway guys i really hope you enjoyed this little um progress report episode thing <laughs> um if you if you really like the videos and you want to subscribe to me that'd be really cool too you just hit that button down below like the video all that good stuff but yeah anyway guys i'll see you later